<sighs> All righty, guys. On today's show, we're going to talk a little bit about fishing reels. As most of you all know, I went fishing with my friend Tom the other day, as you can see from the video here. We did a little skipjack fishing. When we got done, Tom wanted me to back the boat, trailer into water so he could load the boat. And while I was back in the boat, trailer in the water, I noticed something in Tom's back seat. And Tom, I hate to do this to you, but I took it out of your truck so I could use it in this video. And here's what I found in the back of Tom's truck seat. Yeah. Closet Joe Biden supporter. Goes to show you, you never know who's supporting the Biden team. Alrighty, guys. On a serious note, today we're going to talk fishing reels. Hit that subscribe button and let's get started. Alright, guys, we're going to talk Akuma fishing reels. As you can see, Christmas came early for me. Thank you, Akuma. But let me tell you something. I don't use these reels because Akuma sponsors me. I use these reels because I like them. These are the Kuma Cold Water 153Ds. They make these in three models. They make them in the 153D, the 203D, and the 303D, all with different line capacities. I like the 153Ds, the smaller compact version of the reel. The 153 and the 203 have 18 pounds of drag. The 303 has 20 pounds of drag. All these have three ball bearings, two uh, ball bearings, and one real ball bearing. The gear ratio on these is 5.1 to 1. Um, they're great for mono. I put 30 pound mono, or I'll use 65 pound braid. We're opening up the box here. This is the parts list. A little bit about the warranty. Make sure you fill out your warranty on these reels. And we're going to open it up here. I'm going to tell you a little bit about this reel. And why this is the best catfish striper reel on the market. You're going to get a little bag in here. It comes with oil, keep your reel maintenance, and then your reel clamp bolts that go on your reel for your rod. And then here we go, folks. This is it right here. This is the reel. This is the Kuma 153D. It is a level wine reel. Guide your line on your spool has the star drag here that you can tighten down, has the spin spool here, control your, your casting. These reels are really client friendly, hard to backlash as a bait clicker. If you want to free line your bait clicker, the disengage switch can be turned by two ways. One, you can engage it yourself, or two, one thing I like about the cold water, turn the handle and it engages it. Another neat feature, it has the line counter, Line counters are great when you're downlining or your you're, uh, spot lock or you're specifically casting a brush pile or a rock pile or something. These are great. But here, the Akuma 153D. It is a great reel. Here's a little video of the 153 in action. We got there. Go back towards the red bag. What do you need me to do, Bob? Heck, I don't know. We sit here thinking it's a dink, and this thing may have some weight to it, Scott. Look at that, baby. Look at here, baby. Woo! Woo! Yeah! <laughs> dog! There he is. There you go. <laughs> That's what we came for right there. Right, that was a little clip of the 153D in action. Check these guys out, akumafishingusa.com. If you have any questions, feel free to email me. Here's my email address. Till next time. Top lines.